Hi everybody, welcome back. Today I'm going to do a bag review and kind of show you what I've got inside my new gym bag. This bag here, which is stuffed right now, is from Hamilton Perkins Collection and this is called an Earth Bag. This bag was sent to me about three weeks ago and I have been using it ever since I got it because it is really, really suitable for my gym. So for full disclosure, this bag was sent to me for review and when Hamilton's Perkins contacted me, I was quite intrigued about what their bag is about. It is about conscious fashion and when I tell you this bag is really an earth bag, it really, really is. This entire bag is made out of plastic bottles. When I heard that, I was like, what? They use recycled plastic bottles to make this bag and the interior of this bag is made from billboards recycled billboards that you see on the street when i heard that i was like oh my gosh that's an amazing amazing project to have like you make fashion for sustainable environment and it's made really really well when i saw this i was like what this is made of plastic bottles plastic bottles and billboards so i was really really amazed and i was i was like yes of course you know if if it's really really as good as I saw online, I would definitely want to be you know, part of this project and part of this um, initiative. So before I get into the review of this bag, I want to show you the things that I've got inside this bag. So this bag is quite stuffed right now. It's still got a bit of space, but I've got a lot of things inside. I am using it for the gym and I just came back from the gym. So let me show you what I've got. I have a big full-size uh, bath towel, which I always bring along. I have my protein shaker which has got a bit of water inside this is my toiletry case which I've got moisturizer, deodorant, some perfume, I've got some shampoo soap and a moisturizer so I've got that I've got my makeup case which contains just some makeup you know my eyelash curler, my mascara which I used to like but you know it's really expensive and now I like the L'Oreal one um, primer, blush, eyeshadow, yep that's in there. I've got a shoe bag which has, let's see what does it have, oh okay it has my cycling shoes so I do cycling classes and these are just Shimano cycling uh, shoes that I you know you can clip onto the racer bikes. That's in there. I've got another pair of shoes which are just uh, my Nike running shoes. So that's outside. And I've got a laundry bag which I've got some clothes which are dirty clothes, so I'm not going to show that. Let's see. Okay. Oh, and then I've got a... Oh, this should be inside my um, toiletry. This is a Redoxin because I'm having a bit of sore throat right now, so I brought it along. Okay, so as you can see... Oh, wait. There's one more. There's an outside pocket here, which I keep my wallet. I've got uh, earphones. Uh, I've got a lock for the locker. And... Oh, my gym card. Okay. So that's it. This whole bag is empty. So this bag, like I said earlier, it is made of plastic. It feels like cloth. It feels like really, really like denim cloth. It's super, super nice. And inside is made of billboard, like the billboards that we see on the street. So that makes it waterproof because, you know, can you hear that? It's like plasticky. So even if I've got like this kind of water and it spills, I can just wipe it and no problem, you know? entire bag. How cool is that, right? So the bag that I have is the Carolina Blue Earth Bag. It costs $95 and I will link it down below where you can um, go straight to the website and you can take a look at this particular bag. Now the measurements for this bag is 18 inches across, the height is 10 inches and then the depth or, or kind of like the width is 9 inches. So even though that's not like huge, it fits a lot right right now this bag is really functional for me for my gym but I can imagine using this bag as like a weekend bag or like going out you know like you have a short two day two day one night or a three day two night trip it has so much space that you can just put everything inside and you can definitely bring this on board a plane it's not like a big duffel bag where you know the stewardess is gonna be like mm, I think you need to check that in because it's not that big right it's big enough for a lot of things but at the same time it's not like humongous in terms of material this bag is an environmentally friendly bag it is made of plastic bottles recycled plastic bottles more than 17 bottles were used to make this bag and inside 
is billboard. So when they rip the billboards out, they're actually using it to make this bag. It is really amazing. Like even for me, I'm trying to reduce my plastic consumption. Like my best friend uh, was the one who advised me, hey, don't use so much plastics and all that. So a lot of the water bottles in my house is made of glass. Like I do still have some plastic. You know, it's really, really hard to avoid everything out, not plastic. But like my water bottles, my home, you know, water containers, I changed all, all of them to glass. There are some times, like for example this, I forgot to bring my water bottle so I had to buy one. But I try not to so that, you know, you don't want to, I don't want to be like a tree hugger right now. But, you know, co consciously try uh, to make a difference, right? So anyway, when I heard that this was made of recycled plastic bottles, I was like, no way. I need that bag because, yeah, I truly, truly believe in it. I'm like, wow. I cannot believe it. So anyway, the material is plastic and billboards and because of that, it makes the bag waterproof. So you can get, you know, like stuff could be like wet inside but you just take a dry cloth, you wipe it, no problem. In terms of hassle-free, it really, really is, you know, just a big duffel bag, right? The only thing is it doesn't have any inner pockets. So for me to keep my things um, like organized, I do have to use little bags like that. But even my previous gym bag, my Adidas gym bag, even though they had the little kind of like slip pockets at the side, I ended up not I end up not using it because either the entire interior is all black and by the time I you know chuck this, chuck that, everything inside, the pockets on the inside do get damaged, you know, when your shoes are rubbing against it. So I find that I end up not using it. So having this outside pocket is good enough for me because all I need to keep uh, for my, you know, just for the gym or just going, it's little things that I need to reach for quite quickly. So like my wallet or, you know, my phone or just headphones, you know, and then what I was putting in there was my lock. So it's great to have it outside. Having it on the inside after using so many gym bags, I can tell you, I never use the pouches inside. I never use the slip pockets inside. I can't see it. I just dump my things inside. I end up damaging it. So, you know, not having anything inside is absolutely fine for me. So on the website, it says that every interior of the bag is different. And obviously, because it's made of billboards, no two bags are the same. I was like, oh, okay, interesting. If you think about it, that's true, right? If you're going to cut an entire billboard and you're going to get like this little bit here and that little bit there for this bag, no two bags are going to have the same interior. I thought that was really cool. Like, okay, so maybe if you get one, it will be like your interior will be blue or with pictures or you know of anything whereas mine is red with some white lining kind of makes me think mine could be a coca-cola billboard hmm. in terms of price this bag is 95 us dollars and i think that's reasonable considering that it is a recycled bag you know it's it it needs different kind of manufacturing using plastic sourcing plastic and then of course billboards and putting it together it's not our you know usual factory that makes clothes and all it is something different and then when I was comparing it to my Adidas bag right here I remember paying about 80 once I converted 70 to 80 dollars um, for this and you know if I add a little bit more I'd rather buy a bag that can make a difference, you know? I, I'm not being a tree hugger right now, but looking at, actually just looking at the two of them, this looks so much better, and this actually has a purpose, whereas this is just paying for the brand, right? Like, totally. I have it because, you know, it was my gym bag previously. So this is my quick review about this bag, and like I said earlier, I'm gonna link the website down below so you can check it out. And, you know, I don't gain anything from you clicking the link. You know, there is no coupon code, there's nothing. All I got was uh, this bag to talk about. And the only reason I agreed to it was because of the story behind it, the purpose of the bag, the, you know, how they are actually sourcing from all these countries to collect and recycle and when you know I'm gonna link another video about um, how they started on Kickstarter I'm gonna put that down below as well and you should when you know after I watched that I was really really you know you know that heart you're like wow people are really out there making a difference and I want to support that cause so I really hope you guys check it out because I feel that this company Hamilton Perkins is making a difference they are going beyond just fashion and they're just going beyond you know doing you know just earning money I, I feel like there is 
something worth looking at for this company. So anyway, like I said, I don't get anything from you clicking it. Just take a look. It's no obligation, obviously. Now, I'm really, really honored that they contacted me for this bag and it suits really suits my lifestyle like it's so casual and yet so stylish at the same time i will definitely be bringing this bag along with me for my upcoming hokkaido trip it's going to be one of those carry-on bags that i'm going to put along with my luggage because you see it can fall into really really small it's really light as well and i can bring it along so it'll be an extra bag for my shopping needs so you guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you have any questions let me know in the comments down below otherwise i will see you in my next video bye